Welcome back to Silent Hill Downpour. In the last episode, if I remember right, I think we were being chased during a downpour by a bunch of monsters. I was low or completely out of ammo, and I have no midkits left. I just tried to open a door and it turned out it worked, and it turns out it goes to a bank. Which is where we're at right now, at the very beginning of the bank. Looks like our goals are to escape from Silent Hill, stop the patrol cars, find the police patrol dispatcher, which seems kind of like the same quest and find a way to the radio station at the center of town. Oh, right, then we have some side quest stuff. Missing paintings. Oh, I also want to do one thing before I continue. There's an option for object highlighting here. I want to try turning it on, because I spend quite a lot of the game, honestly, uh, just going around and waiting for a prompt to pop up to say, like, hey, there's something there. And, like, 90% of the time, it's just a weapon that I don't want. So let's... Let's turn that on and see if it makes anything better. Ah, I see. Occasional shine. All right. Chair, piece of wood, another piece of wood. Yeah, I don't need any of that. Yeah, I wouldn't have found half of this stuff. Not that any of it matters. Ooh. Is that a special mm -hmm. flashlight? Because I already had one. No? Huh. You pick it up, but you just still have just the one flashlight. It's weird that there isn't a line that says something like, I already have one. Oh, did I just ditch the other one? Is that what happens? Oh, that's what happens. Gotcha. Yeah, this game seems kind of open world, so I, I could see why they would put a bunch of these around, just in case you missed one of them. You don't want someone to go through the whole game without having a flashlight. I have the lighter, but it sucks. Also, I don't remember how to turn the lighter on. I did just find that there's a shortcut, apparently, to take out your gun. Um, so you could just go up to the inventory, select it this way, equip it. Which then tosses your melee weapon, but it looks like if you press left on the D-pad, it just does the whole thing. Oh! Okay. Hmm. Also, I just found out you can fire your gun without aiming it. Just kind of hip fire it. Whoops. Okay, so left on the D-pad switches to the weapon. Up opens the inventory, right? Uses a medkit, which I don't have. Downs the lighter. Process of elimination. Let's go down first. Oh, the, the vault's open. Why am I excited by that? It's not like money matters right now. I wonder what objects it highlights. Obviously weapons. It doesn't highlight openable doors. Does it highlight, like, notes? Can I just loot this place? Is it gonna be like ammo in here? Do people put ammo in safety deposit boxes? An alarm, of course. How could I be so stupid? Okay. Hmm? What the hell? What am I hearing? I know there's enemies here, but it... But what am I hearing? Exactly, what are they doing up there? Swinging at the air? Hello? Oh, hi. Yeah. 
Jesus, this camera, please. What kind of a bank is this? I don't understand at all. Why did that open? Oh, Jesus. This is the silliest thing. You, you kill each wave and you open up another vault? Okay, I am seriously hurt. I don't know if there's gonna be more waves. There were certainly more boxes to open, but I, I'm gonna go see if there's a med kit down here. Maybe? Did somebody put a med kit in a safety deposit box? That's definitely another wave. Somebody did put a medkit in a safety deposit box. This is the goofiest thing. Okay. Pistol bullets, yes. Well, there's like three more or something, so I guess three more waves? <laughs> okay. What if I just go upstairs? Maybe there's another way around this. Oh, shit. They can come up here. Um, hmm. But can you come through a door that won't close? This should stop that damn noise. Ah. Thank God. Thank God for that prompt. I wouldn't have known it was there otherwise. I just saw something pop up. Ah, oh, yes, another fire axe thing. I assume the enemies are still here. No, they they left. Okay. Right, turn off the alarm. Enemies despawn. That makes sense. None of this makes any sense. Get it? It's either you do the whole thing or, I mean, you can choose whenever you want to stop it, but you only have the one chance. Survive as long as you can and then press the button. Shit. Oh, well, I would have went longer if I knew that. Is there, is there a button to open it back up? What if I press the button upstairs again? Seems like there's no way to reactivate the thing, so I just loaded my save game back from when I first came into the bank. I just did everything that I did before. I went through two waves, got the health kit and the ammo. Now I'm about to fight the third wave. Let's do it.
Okay, we got one of the strong ones down there. Uh, I'm clutching my side. I'm gonna take my med kit. That's the only one I've got. I should probably use my pistol on the one downstairs, definitely. Okay, we got two more to go. They're already getting pretty hard and I have no medkits, so I'm worried. But hopefully there's something good down there. Another medkit, preferably. Maybe more ammo. Ooh. Oh. Oh, I guess it's just like the flashlight. That's a pistol for if I didn't already have a pistol. Since I do, I just get the ammo. That's fine. Try to melee this one. Oh, right, you can't block that. Can you not come down the stairs? No, you can. Are you dead? Oh. Uh, hmm. I think there's another one. I'm gonna use my pistol if there's another one. Yep. just got the big one left. Also, my axe is probably gonna break pretty soon. And I already replaced it with the one upstairs, so... Can't go get that one. Well, I can get my old one, but... Probably not the greatest idea. More ammo? Pistol bullets, yes. How much ammo do I have? Four out of seven, plus... Ten. Let's reload this thing. How do I reload this thing? <laughs> Do I use the bullets? Reload. There we go. Um, hmm. I guess I'll take this upstairs. Just for finishing them off, if nothing else. But yeah, there's. I think there's two or three of them up there. Probably three. What was that weird distortion? Okay, okay. Go, 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 I need to get upstairs, I need room, this is not going great. Hi. I don't want to waste ammo on you, please get out of here. No, 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 I'm out of ammo. Okay, 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 okay. No, run. Mm. No, run, run, run. Oh, this is gonna be bad. Damn it. Come on, come on. I got a strong attack off. 
Yes, yes, yes. Actually, upstairs is the no 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 get out get out spare get my spare so close holy shit three med kits oh is that worth all my ammo maybe that might be so given that i used all these med kits i came out of this with plus two med kits at the end of it right or no plus three because i came in here with zero. Oh, but i'm going to use one so yeah i'm going to come out with plus two med kits and minus like a magazine of pistol rounds Maybe worth it? It was satisfying, if nothing else. Huh. I'm not gonna take that chair with me. Oh hey, I'm not quite done here yet. I can go behind the counters. Okay, plus three med kits. That's definitely worth it. It's also the other side to check, too. Yo, people! I just got off the phone with a real nice lady named Sarah over in Bronx. Sarah wanted me to play some sailing music for her hubby Edward, who's got his boat out skimming through those crisp Toluca Lake waves today. Sarah says she always gets a little nervous when old Ed takes the boat out. But DJ Ricks is here to say there ain't nothing to worry about, girl. It's always smooth sailing in Toluca, where the water is almost as fine as the music we play. Just for you and your man, here at WLMN-FM. Okay, I have no idea where I'm going to go outside, because I only reached this place by accident, just running and trying doors. I hope the downpour's over. I have no ammo. I do have a bunch of medkits, though. But, uh... Yeah, I have no idea where I'm actually going. Trying to escape Silent Hill. I'm sure that's uh, the big quest that we'll be doing probably in a long time for now. I'm trying to find the police dispatch stuff. Trying to find the radio tower at the center of town. Some, whoa, screen, calm down, please. Centennial building? Might be it, I'm not sure. There's lots of closed off roads. I really don't know where to go. I was totally lost when I came to this place. But I do know that I originally came from over here, I think. Ran along here, so I guess I'll just go this way. Don't think I've been this way. Ooh, yes, nice. Oh shit. Oh, it's on the other side. Huh. Shovel. Better? Probably not. This thing's kind of sharp. Shovel's not really. Is there ever a reason to pick up bottles? Considering that you can only hold one weapon, one melee weapon at a time? Would a bottle ever be better than anything else? That's a weapon? Huh. Eh, 
Too fragile. We're on Cook Street. There's a question mark ahead. That's one I've already been to, though. Don't remember what that one was about. I honestly don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Shit. Well, oh, they've already seen me. We are finding some other place to go. That's a pile of trash. Thank god they're very easy to outrun. You know what? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Is that usable? What is this? What? Oh, I need to... <clears throat> I need to use coins on it. Actually, they're not around me. Let's use coins. Candy bar! Great! More? No? Okay. Where did everyone else go? Maybe I ditched him. I'm really bad at combat. Like, just absolutely terrible. Candy bar is probably a minor healing item. This is new. Yeah. Alright, let's eat the candy bar. A Granny Pat's 100% organic milk chocolate bar. Oh, wait, I, I can't actually eat it. Huh. Okay. Can you use the med kit from the menu? You can. So it's not like you have to press the heal button to, p to possibly use this, it's just that you can't eat it. It's a quest item? Another creepy grave. What was that? Pick up? Oh, is it this... Wait, no, what is it? Oh, almost invisible. I'm not sure what that is. Maybe a... Yeah, I sounded metal. I think it's a pipe. This is still better. Is this somewhere new? I don't know. This game is hard as hell to navigate. Door? Have I been here? I know I've been in some apartments recently, I just don't know if I've been in this one. Loading. Oh no, I definitely haven't been in this one. So if it needs to load when you're opening a door, it just prevents you from opening it until it loads? That's interesting. Anyway, this place seems to be possessed. Huh. 
Oh, that's one of the paintings that I need for the treasure hunt thing. This looks like one of those weird paintings. <laughs> and it stopped rocking. Oh, that's the flash when the downpour is going to happen soon. I guess this happen even if you're indoors. It makes sense, it just wouldn't surprise me if time also kind of stood still outside when you're inside. But it looks like it doesn't. Wait. Oh, the door's boarded over. How grimy those windows are. I really like the environments in Downpour. They're very good. How everything looks, how everything sounds. Like something as simple as the creak of that chair that was rocking back and forth sounded fantastic. Look at how disheveled everything is. Messed up blinds. Paint deteriorated down to, I don't know, concrete over brick? Like three different layers of stuff? Everything looks so lived in. this one. Have I been here before then? Yeah, we got a loading screen here before too when I came in from the other direction. So I have been here, I just missed that one downstairs apartment, I guess? Or maybe that whole painting thing. Maybe you can't take the painting and the chair doesn't rock until you have that quest for the paintings. That could be it too. Hmm. Well, in that case there's probably nothing in these other apartments, but there might be. No other paintings in that building. So, fast forward a little bit, fought an enemy or two, ran around a bunch, downpour happened, just looking around for where I'm actually supposed to go, and I think I found it. Remember this subway access down here that I found? and. Went in here and saw this and thought, oh, well, guess I'm not going in this way. Well, it turns out you can go in this way. You just gotta really, really look out for these tight little spots you can go through. They're very hard to see. Hello. Damn rain never lets up, does it? Man can catch his death out here. Of course, if you could spare something to eat, I could show you another way to get around town, keep your head dry. Well, you say, friend, that's a fair trade, ain't it? That's what the chocolate bar's for. I just used a med kit. <sighs> Sorry, it's not much, but you're welcome to it. You got a map of the town? Let me show you something. Okay, so that's the subway that I can take. Pleasant River, Port District, Pearl Creek, Chastain Heights, Hillside. So is Pearl Creek like this entire map, or how did, I'm not quite sure how this map's on. Um, I see Highway 73. Hmm. 
Uh, I'm not sure. We'll, See that? We'll probably figure There's it out. Tunnels all over Silent Hill, connecting one part of town to the other. You just gotta think like a rat, see? A rat's vermin. But he knows how to survive. How to stay out of the rain. You think like a rat, kid, and you'll be fine. Just like a woman. I tell you what. It gets awful cold most nights. If you found me a coat to keep warm, I could show you some more shortcuts to keep you dry. You just come back here and find me. Yeah, sounds good. That's cool that we learn the lay of the land from a local. Amazing that there's somebody here who's not a monster and alive. What's this? What is that? It's like a little stand? What could possibly go there? I guess nothing I have. Words. Pleasant River 3, Pearl Creek 2. Does that have a sign? Where does that go? Huh. Don't know. That's new. Is that a bedpost? That's wood, right? Yeah. It's interesting, but I'd rather have this. I guess I'll just pick a direction and go. Let's go the mysterious way. Does it show on the map? Yeah. Oh, there's even a question mark over this one, I guess. Wait, why is there a question mark over this one? Either Chastain Heights or Hillside. Is that a level transition? Or Death Fog? Level transition? Okay. Very weird looking one. You see the overworld map too. Yeah, so that brings me all the way over here. Still on this map, but kind of on the outskirts of it, into a place that I've never been before. Pretty sure. Alright, cool. Let's check it out. I gotta try to shove my body through every even tiny hole if I see it, just in case. I just can't go this way. <laughs> Why did they make me wait so long to find that out? Yeah, just get to the very end and then the very last door is locked. Let's go the other way to Hillside. Ooh, that's one of the paintings. This looks like one of those weird paintings. I love the crunchy glass noises. Yes, this one works. Wait, what was that? What did I just pick up? Just took me to this map, but this is the one I already had? I don't get it. 
Maybe that's if you somehow got here without talking to the homeless person? Is, is that even possible? I guess it probably is. It's like an extra map in case you didn't get it. Ah, oh, freaking cop cars. I really gotta get rid of them. So where are we now? Oh, hey, we're actually near the police station. Okay, cool. I'm assuming I haven't been here, but it's honestly hard to tell. Actually, this looks kind of familiar? This feels awfully familiar. Anyway, let's head to the police station. On my right, a little bit down the street. Yeah, this is it. Sledgehammer. Sure. Now we just gotta find the way into this place. Maybe a ladder I can take down? Oh, come on. I can't get through that. Freaking police tape or something. Oh. Please don't see me here. Please don't see me here. Please don't see me here. Yes. Yeah, I've definitely been here before. I think this is kind of where I started or something. Well, that doesn't sound good. Uh, there we go. Definitely haven't been here. We are in the police station now. Cool. 